Alrighty then, let's see. What I'm doing, I think, I was gonna I was think about using the coat hanger wire, but I think I can take a welding stick and break the slag off of it and slide it in between. Then I can pick the banjo up and move it around with that. Hardest part is to uh, break the slag off of it. But, oh, I think I can manage that. <clears throat> get y'all one. Let me get my little banjo stand over here. Mess around with this here. All I'm doing is taking my little leather man breaking the slag. I, what am I saying? I'm calling that slag, but it's not. What is that called? Flux. Is that called flux? Anyway, I'm breaking the stuff off this uh, welding rod. This is a plain old 6011. Nothing too fancy about that. Just about the right size to go through those banjo bolt holes. See, that's good. That'll work. That'll work just fine. I'll take these back out to the garage in a little while. So, let's get my varnish out. See if it's still good. I used this uh, last time I used it was on a rifle. It came out real nice. So let's see what we got. If we still got any that's good, that varnish will uh, kind of. That's when you use an old can like that. It'll kind of harden up on you. Form a seal on top of itself. And you have to poke a hole and cut that layer of hardened varnish out of it. I'm going to get me a little bag here and just try to lift that out and put it into the bag without getting it all over everything else. See if we can. Making quite a mess there. Now I'll get me a little stick and stir it up. Really nothing fancy going on here. All we want to do is coat this all over and all the way around. I'm going to do the inside then I'll do the outside. Okay then, now I just need to find a way to hang that up somewhere where it won't come to damage. <clears throat> it may be that uh, this coat hanger would work well for that. Probably should have bent it before, but oh, I think that'll work just like that. We got a hook right up there. We can hang it up there right over that stove. That would be good. Yeah, that would be just perfect. That way the heat from the stove can kind of help that to get done. Oh, oh the joy. Alrighty then. So I'm going to close this back up and set it away and clean all those nuts and bolts and then I'll work on the neck. Uh, these brushes I kind of buy to throw away. These are like 99 cent brushes. A lot of times I don't even bother cleaning them because they ain't worth it. So I think I will throw that away. This can go in the wood box. So there.